so some of you, come here, Freddie, have asked me to get a little more in depth about uh, the choice game where you have the fistful of treats and you show it to the dog and they're building self control. Well, here's the thing of it is that this is not a leave it exercise. You've heard me say that before. It's about the building and the growth of the dog's self control. Does that make more sense? Okay, so I am going to present a fistful of treats. If she goes for it, all I do is slowly close my fist. When she looks at me, I will mark and treat. You can treat from here or you can treat from a neutral spot. I've been challenged on that um, by some folks. And you know what? Quite frankly, I found it does not make a difference. But this is about the building of the self-control and the length of this dog can control themselves. So we are going to present the treats, close our fist. If she goes for it, yes, mark and treat. Yes. 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 Raising the criteria by opening my fist. So again, it's not a leave it, um, it's not about whether the dog can or can't leave it alone. It's about the growth of that self-control, even the little bits of it, okay? And the public gets one too, because it's waiting so patiently. This, hope that makes a little more sense. If it's still a little confusing to you, shoot me a note and I'll help you, I'll walk you through it. We'll practice it again, yes. Yes. Good. Okay? Remember, training should be what? Training should be fun. I can help you with that. 